I'm Eileen Holland, and today I'm reading you Chapter 2 from my new book, Sophie Trophy 2. Chapter 2, The Left Out Feeling. Miss Ruby is telling Sophie's class that they will be performing a song at the next assembly. I found a song about the moon and the sun. As you sing, you'll do actions with these. Miss Ruby tipped the box she was holding. Everyone sucked in their breath. Mini flashlights, red, yellow, green, and royal blue. Miss Ruby darkened the classroom. Once you pick a flashlight, move it in different directions, making lines and shapes. Her teacher let students choose a flashlight from the box. Everyone please think up flashlight actions and write them down. Why might we keep flashlights at home? Brayden raised his hand. For emergencies and stuff. Sophie grinned. Or to find long lost treasure in your attic. Everyone laughed, especially Haley. Sophie's eyebrows hippity hopped. That kid laughs a lot. I like that. Maybe Haley could be her friend. Sophie glanced at her. Haley didn't dress like Sophie or act shy or scared. Nope, we're too different. You're dreaming, Sophie, Miss Ruby said. Everyone's listing flashlight actions. Sophie nodded. She started her list. I want yellow, Haley said. I do too, and Noli smiled at Haley. What? And Noli's favorite color is green. Does she want yellow because Haley does? Watching them, Sophie got the left out feeling. Think about colors instead. Queens and princesses wear royal blue dresses and royal blue capes and royal blue jewels and use royal blue flashlights. I want royal blue, cried Sophie. Neither girl looked her way. Sophie sighed. Jordy chose his flashlight. Look, Sophie, I got royal blue. You'll be the last to pick by the window. You won't even get a choice. Sophie wolf snarled at him. By the time Miss Ruby reached Brayden, there were two flashlights left. I know you want blue, Soph, so I'll take green. Really? Yeah, Brayden smiled. Thanks. Sophie clicked it on. Nothing happened. She shook it. Smashed light bulb bits and cracked lens pieces fell to the floor. Her lip quivered. Aww. Braden frowned. Is it wrecked, Soph? Yes. Ah, uh -huh, cried Jordy. Haley looked at Sophie with sad eyes. Sophie said, Miss Ruby, I have a mini flashlight in my car you can use. Sophie tried to smile. Her mouth had a hard time turning upward. Do you own a flashlight, Sophie? Yes, for camping, plus one a firefighter gave me at the teddy bear picnic. Miss Ruby's eyes dance. Nice! And a headlamp, a flashlight you wear on your forehead. Wow, said Miss Ruby. I also have a zebra flashlight and a cookie flashlight. Everyone near Sophie laughed. Haley caught her eye. I'd like to see your flashlights. You would, asked Sophie. Jordy grinned. If we all fall down a giant bunny hole, Sophie Trophy can rescue us with her dumb cookie flashlight. The boys near him burst out laughing. What's dumb is Jordy's nickname for me and the way Anoli does what Haley does.